Gemini, this is your week ahead tarot card reading from Born Without Boundaries Tarot. This is a Gemini sun, moon, and rising sign reading. It is a Gemini energy reading, so check it out and please apply it to where it resonates in your life. Um, interesting. Okay. Let's just jump right in. Guys, if you want a full astrology breakdown, I have a second YouTube channel called Astrology Motivation. Please catch that reading over there. You can go subscribe over there and get that. It's a weekly reading where I dive deep into the specifics of the astrology and how they impact you. Here, this is an intuitive tarot card reading for whoever it resonates for. Obedience. And you see this card? It's disobedience. Obedience is not obedience. It's, it's, it's feeling like you, it's, it's, it's a guise. It's pretending so that you're sneaking in or you're pretending about who you are. There's some sort of deception here or a feeling of trying to fit in and trying to hide darker aspects of yourself. We have house. So this could have something to do specifically with family. I don't know if it's somebody like devil with the blue dress on in your family or just the sense of I have to hide who I am from my family because there isn't comfort level or there isn't a level of acceptance here. There could also be, this may not be your house or your family, but a house as in a structure that's been built. Remember, Mercury is now going into Taurus. So there is a sense of you're dealing with Mercury is really non-conformist. It doesn't go one way or the other. So there is a sense of now you're now you have to like feel like you have to sort of put on this air in order to fit in because you're dealing with a lot of people who are not open to chains or chains or chains or change or adjustments. I apologize. Um, this is kind of rupturous. There's something that's maybe not happening this week, but it's set to happen because there has been some sort of deception surrounded by people who really weren't looking for it, who just expected everything to stay the same, but something has entered, the, some, something snuck in. Somebody looked like they belonged, but they really didn't. They were a disruptor, sort of dressed as a... Um, I don't know, a suit and tie, that, that kind of energy. That's really interesting. I don't know how that's impacting you. Let's get into it. Let's see. How, how does any of this relate? It sounds like something political or global, but how is this impacting Gemini's strength? So you've set your courage. You've built your strength. There's been some sort of defeat that you're dealing. Oh, I understand. This is almost some like, like a stealth attack. There is this sense of you have your strength. You understand what it takes. Maybe this is intentionally fake so you can go place that disruptive whatever and and sort of just, just so that you can get it past security, that kind of energy, because we have the five of swords as well. Let me think on this, please. This is defeat. But how are you dealing with defeat? You aren't... You use defeat to get stronger, to increase your power. Or somebody has used what looked to be defeat. Looks to be like, oh, somebody's got me. But in reality, it, you just positioned yourself to be even stronger. Or this is a comeback where you now, because you've, you've, you've been in this struggle, you've been in this fight, they may have defeated you, but now you know their weaknesses and you know exactly how to dress up to deliver it. I don't know what this is yet. Bear with me. We have the emperor here. This is definitely somebody who is a leader, somebody who is established. I almost feel like somebody's being ruthless here. Let's put it this way. You are making a comeback. And whatever you've been through has made you come back that much more fierce and that much more certain of yourself. So I don't know what you're fighting for, but you've come back to win and to absolutely destroy anybody who gets in your way. Damn. 
is all I've got to say. Okay. Somebody has come back stronger. Hermit, somebody's been doing work in private. Or there has been some secret exchanges. This is also a sense of somebody has done healing and come back stronger. Especially, let me say this, especially if this is physical. This has something to do with a body part that was wounded. There is this sense of, yes, like coming back stronger. You did like recently, and it could be this week, that you suffer a defeat, but it's saying you will be able to retaliate even stronger. And maybe because of the defeat, somebody thinks you're down permanently. You are not. This is like you're going to pop up again quickly. So whoever counts you out is really stupid. Now, we have the hermit energy, which is all about healing and slow and steady wins the race. It's all about cultivation. It's also going it alone. And maybe having to travel sort of in disguise and and just follow in faith we have another disguise here this sense of not all is as it seems i'm just seeing this repeated pattern here so let me i'm gonna yes judgment card so not all is as it seems and it does seem like almost in a way things are going to get at you or somebody's trying to hurt you they may be sneaking you in so that, you know, just making it look like, oh, they're not on my side, but they really are because they're helping to sneak you in. Because there's a judgment that's going to be made in your favor and things are going to come out on top. I think that this, this is your ammo is just hidden right now. I don't know what this is about, but I'm so curious to find out. Let's pull a moon card. Let's pull a moon card. No, you know what? Let's not yet. Let's get the answers. What is this? What is this about? Like, what's hidden for Gemini this week? Ooh, what is hidden? What is hidden? A change in the world. A change. A, a, an overarching global change that's happening this week. And that is going to impact how you end up executing i don't so that's the chain what what is it though what is it though it's big it's bigger than just you um it's almost like you deceived people you pretended like you didn't have money or there was some sort of distraction that when it when it came to people not seeing whether or not somebody it has something to do with somebody not really showing or deceiving how much money they really had because it seems like they were putting up a lot of walls or a lot of illusions because they didn't want somebody to see that you know their finances were at risk or that something had kind of gone broke so it's got something to do with that, okay? Let's pull a moon card now. And we gotta go deeper, we gotta get more details. Gemini, bring love into the situation. That's coming up in the future though. And your hard work is paying off. Whatever you're, you're scheming or whatever's happening now, it's saying that not too long in the future, maybe by the end of this week, bring love into the situation so and then your hard work is paying off let me say this it's almost like you you're trying to look like the enemy and fraternize with the enemy so that you can actually sort of blow them up from the inside not really but but and then and then make level everything to make it more fair and it's going to be soon by the end of this week that people are going to discover you actually did everything that you wanted to do. You actually executed everything that you wanted to do, even if you had to use sleight of hand to do it. The sense of make somebody look over here and think that I'm actually doing something over here, distract them so they don't see what I'm actually doing over here, which is setting up the totally unexpected, which is I'm doing this for love. I'm doing this to create space for love. I'm, I'm gonna and I'm gonna see that my hard work has paid off this could be up to two weeks out because we have a, a new moon that's coming um, on April 20th so we just had a full moon right we had a full moon today this is a sense of 
it's almost going to surprise people by the new moon what is revealed but you're going to you're not going to be surprised because you were in on it i don't know what is going on here oh my god gemini okay can you just please help me out here god because we do have venus going into gemini by the end of this week so there is this sense of look something has paid off maybe something that you i don't know like what we're trying to be distracted from or we're, we're trying to like not think about or take attention to take attention off of this so i can actually fix things the way that i want and then come out and everything's ready and prepared that kind of energy nine of pentacles and nine of pentacles is here and then the chariot so this is you go from broke like pretending that you don't have any money or from trying to disguise so people don't see it because you're waiting for the check to come in you know what i'm saying it's almost like writing out a check in advance like a a, a post-dated check that kind of thing it's like it's like until you have it but it's going to be your you are going to have it there is value coming in and it's going to be as soon as it comes you can move forward and drive forward and you will absolutely get it this week this is also a sense of finally your value being acknowledged so that you can move forward you could also be going on some kind of tour or trip because your value has come in it's like waiting for that paycheck to come in right before you leave it's like you leave on the 20th your paycheck drops on the 21st I gotta fake it till i make it until then that kind of energy but there is a value behind this and it's coming in and it's basically saying this is going to pay off in advancement maybe you're buying a new car maybe it's that simple Let's get some more details, please, for Gemini. What is paying off? What is paying off? Progress, eight of wands, things are going to move fast. And opportunity. So lots of opportunities are coming your way. Um, this is going to happen quickly. And you have eight of wands and eight of cups. So something with the full moon, it's like all these opportunities that finally came in allow you to walk away from the stuff you don't really care about. It's almost like you were just biding your time with something you don't really care about until what you needed to head toward what you do care about came in. And it is definitely going to come in. And then you could just get in your chariot and take off. That's what's going on. And if you're wondering, is it going to, it is absolutely going to come in sometime around or right after the full moon. And so definitely by in two weeks from now, you'll be in the position where you can demonstrate what you've actually been doing and what you've actually been thinking and what's actually been going on. Oh, the intrigue, Gemini. I hope I'm not blowing up your spot. How is this working out for Gemini? King of Wands is here, so it could have something to do with a Leo, Aries, or we have Aries on the table, or Sagittarius. It's almost like you've pent up this energy. You've waited. You've guarded it, and you've protected this energy. Maybe you were trying to protect somebody specifically. Um, this could just be a fire sign or somebody who's really creative or something that you have created that you have been trying not to talk about because you didn't want it attacked or torn down. And so your MO is to make sure that it debuts or that you announce something at just the right time. Oh, okay. Listen, there's always an extended reading and I hope you guys will join me for it. That link is in the description box below, pinned to the top of the comment section. I attach it here so you can click right on it and get right to it. If you're on a television set, you won't have access to any of the links because TV sets don't. So please grab your cell phone, laptop, or desktop and just the, all the links will work. Um, what exactly... Okay, so... How will Gemini know the time is right? I think that's a question that I really want to ask. How will Gemini know when the time is right? King of Swords is here. 
there's it's you it's you're going to decide when the time is right but I also got in my head when an official decision comes through it's almost like that's the catalyst that's when you know okay Ali Ali oxen free I can come clean let's go to the extended I will see you guys there